Now that we've finished the assembly on our plow system, we're going to show you how to install it onto your ATV. We're going to do this by lifting on the frame handle here to engage the frame hooks into the integrated chassis mount. Now that we're partially engaged, we're going to extend our winch lead to connect to our winch link and lift the system so that it is fully engaged. Before doing this, ensure that our locking handle is in the unlocked upward position. Now that our plow frame is engaged with our vehicle frame, we can press down on our red lever to lock the whole system in place. Now that we've completed the installation of our plow system onto our ATV, we can walk through some of the different adjustment points that you have with this plow system. The first of which is our blade tension spring. We've got two springs on the left and right. To adjust our blade tension springs, we're going to tighten or loosen the nut down on the bottom of our post here. That would allow us to increase or decrease tension on our spring and that will affect the amount of holdback that we have at the top of the blade. Our next point of adjustment is our angle adjustment block here. You can see that on this block, each side of, of the block here is a different size. And by loosening this nut and rotating the block, it adjusts how much the top of our blade tips forward or backward. From the factory, our blade angle adjustment block is set in the ideal position. If you'd like to change the position of the block, that will allow you to tip the top of the blade forward or backward, which will allow you to have a more or less aggressive cut with your blade. Our next adjustment piece is on the wear shoe down here. Our plow wear shoes can be adjusted up and down to affect the height that your blade, plow blade rides above the ground. By removing our pin, that allows us to move our shoe up and down, affecting that clearance. Once you're happy with your position, reinsert the pin, and you're ready to go. Ensure that both sides, left and right, on your shoes are adjusted the same. Okay. Our winch link can be adjusted by tightening or loosening the nut on the back side of the plow frame here. Adjusting that position of the nut allows us to adjust where the plow stops in its up and down travel as our winch is reeled in. To adjust your blade angle, lift up on the angle adjustment lever and rotate the blade left or right. Be sure that the blade angle adjustment lever clicks back into place before beginning plowing. To remove the plow system from your ATV, let out the winch, lowering the blade to the ground and disconnect the winch lead from the plow frame. With our winch lead disconnected, we're going to lift up on our locking lever to unlock and pull forward from the ATV to disengage the plow frame from the vehicle. Be sure to retract the winch cable. For more information on Polaris engineered accessories, go to your Polaris website or contact your local Polaris dealer.